Hey guys, Kelly here at Mindful Body Works. So today I want to show you a stretch that you can do for your pec muscles, pec minor, pec major. Um, you'll get some extra stretching in there for some other muscles as well, but that's really what we're targeting. So the reason it's so important to stretch out to your upper chest, your pecs, is because with posture today, whether you're sitting um, hunched over a computer or you're looking down at your phone, um, posture has a huge effect on the neck, the upper back, and even the mid and low back as well. So it's really important to stretch out your chest. Um, one way that you can do that is while you're sitting at your desk or sitting in your house or at your laptop, if you bring your shoulder blades together and down the back, it opens the chest and it also tightens and strengthens the upper back. So if you set an alarm on, say, your watch or your phone to do that every hour, that would be absolutely wonderful for your posture. That would strengthen and tighten your upper back muscles so that it's easier for you to have good posture. Now, for those of you who need to open up the chest, there's a simple pec stretch that I like to do on a door jam, but you can do it at any wall. You don't have to have a door jam. A lot of you have seen it where you go through the door jam with the double arms. Well, I don't really like that one because a lot of times one arm has more range of motion than the other arm. So this way we're going to isolate one side at a time. So what we want to do is we want to do a stretch for high. And what I'm doing is I'm just turning my body away from my arm. So I'm stretching out that pec muscle. Stretching out the chest. I want to make sure I breathe into this and then release. And then going to a medium stretch here. And then I'm going to go to a low stretch. Now with the low stretch, you're going to have to move closer to the wall or the door jam to do this. And you turn your body away from your arm or your hand. So again, high medium and low and that's going to open up the front of the shoulder and the chest it's really going to help you now keep in mind even if one side is tighter than the other side you want to make sure that you do this on both sides so if you hold each stretch for about 10 to 15 seconds while you're breathing that would be very effective you can also do one arm and then come back do the other arm and then um, repeat both sides again. So by stretching out your chest, having good posture, you're going to have less issues with your head, your neck, and your upper back, even your low back if you have better posture. Uh, this can also help with headaches as well. If you have better posture and you're taking pressure off of those posterior neck muscles, then it will be even better for any neck and head issues. All right, so I hope you enjoyed this video. It's nice and quick, super easy to do. You can do it anywhere, um, at the office, at home, cooking dinner. So just make sure you give it a shot. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon. Thank you so much.